Hey guys, this video is going to be comparison between SAT and IIT J exam and with the help of this video, you will find out which exam is better for your career so that you can get accepted to the best universities in the world. But before talking about SAT or IIT J, I want to tell you why you should SAT consider SAT in your 11th and 12th. Is there any bad in IIT? Mein? No, not at all. It's just the stress level of IIT exams are way, way too much that every year more than 10 students in Kota City commit suicide. Sirf Kota city, a small si city, so many people suicide. Kar rahe and and in, in India, like more than 50,000 students committed suicide in the last three and four years because of IITJ stress or other need or aims related stress, especially students. So that's a huge number. And that's why you should consider other backup options. You don't think that IITJ is the only option. You have SAT, Germany, all options explore options. And that's what this video is about. So without any further ado, let's get started. So now the number one difference is the stress level because acceptance rate to get into the best IITs is way too low, especially for general category. If you want to take IIT Bombay in computer science, lena ho, it's almost nearly impossible because like barely a handful of students get into IIT Bombay for computer science. And to choose stream, it's even more difficult. If you have your IIT J exam mein, and if you are able to get good score in your J mains and advance, then also it, it is not guaranteed that you will get computer science because you will be getting your university depending on your rank. If rank is good, then also it's going to be difficult to decide because the general category is difficult. Hoti hai. So that's why the acceptance rate to get into IIT Bombay computer science is nearly 0.5% or 0.05%. The calculations will be here. So it's very, very difficult as compared to MIT, Harvard, the best universities in the world. There is acceptance rate hota hai, 5% to 7%. So there's a huge, huge difference. So that's why it is it is more stressful and less stressful over there. But remember one thing, if you have 1600 out of 1600, if you can get 100% scores in SAT, APs, SAT subject tests, there's no guarantee that you will get into the top university like MIT, Harvard. But if you get 100% score in IITJ mains or advance, then to guarantee that you will get IIT Bombay. Mil then there's a 100% guarantee that you will get into IIT Bombay or any IIT of your choice. So that's also a difference to keep in mind because abroad, mein, other factors like extracurriculars, achievements, your uh, your leadership achievements, as I already talked about in this video, which is Suti Khandwala. So you should definitely watch her journey that how, what extracurricular activities she had. But now this doesn't mean that you should choose one thing. You shouldn't like only consider SAT or IDJ mains because you should do both. But one thing at a time. Choose one thing, right? Like, like because SAT, ko, you just need one month of good preparation, and some students even got a great score in one week. So, what you should do is once you get a good score in SAT, mein score hai, get back into IIT because extracurriculars are very important. And our children, who just want to study, and students like us who are just into studies, don't know anything about extracurricular, they can also make their ways by taking IITJ exam because they can make an extracurricular achievement ban sakta hai by taking the test series. Let's say that you join test series like Fit G, etc. And if you get good ranks in some of those exams, and that's also an achievement like because Fit G's test series or Akash test series are also national level. So with those test series also, you can put in your extracurricular achievement and you will be good to go to get into top universities. And also, essay is very important. Once again, in the same video I talked about, aapki story unique honi chahiye. You have to be unique, you have to be like out of the box idea and you also have to think about making a huge impact to this world. So now moving on, the next difference is in SAT math and oh my god, SAT math is way, way easier as compared to IITJ and Zameen Asman ka farak hai. A normal student, an average student who is preparing for IITJ can get easily 780 or 800 in math because level jo hota hai, 10th and 11th in, beech ka hota hai, in between 10th and 11th math. So it's very, very easy and I have to tell you that jo IIT ki math thi na, back in three years ago, when I gave IITJ mains, diya, that was even difficult the, than the core college math that I took here. Even difficult than math in MIT as well because I have given sample tests in MIT. Ke bhi diye de, so our IIT the exams is the most difficult paper in the world. It's not that it's difficult but the 
but the acceptance rate makes it more stressful and more difficult that's why suicide rates are so high so this proves the fact that agar ek bachcha iit je ki preparation karke aur iit crack karke or if a student clears the iit je exams and then goes to mit then he will have a better intellect as compared to any student because iit je exam is one of the most difficult exam in the world so that's the reason but there's a possibility that the student who graduated from MIT will have more practical experience more exposure more practical knowledge as compared to the student who graduated from IIT and also i would like to add on that in SAT math you are allowed to use calculators but and personally most of the students use TI-84 usme program kar sakte ho you can program some of the formulas and using those formulas you can get your answer quickly so that's even more helpful and some of the IIT and some of the smart IIT students they get 800 like within seconds in SAT math so you must consider now also talking about SAT subject tests because these are recommended for top universities like MIT Harvard Georgia Tech etc to uska bhi bahut fayda hota hai and SAT math physics chemistry oh my god it is way way easy if a student like me could get 750 above or 700 above in all three exams then you can as well so you should definitely consider if you're going for top universities and also you have to consider the need blind and need aware schools jahan pe aap free mein सकते हो वे यू कैन स्टडी फॉर फ्री एब्सोलूटली फ्री डिपेंडिंग ऑन योर पेरेंट्स इनकम सो डू चेक आउट दिस वीडियो एज वेल एंड उस यूनिवर्सिटीज में आपको अप्लाई करना ही करना है एटलीस्ट टू टू थ्री यूनिवर्सिटीज फ्रॉम दैट लिस्ट सो डू चेक दैट आउट सो नाउ लेट्स टॉक अबाउट हाउ टू मैनेज एस सी टी एंड आई टी जेई टूगेदर और मुझे अभी भी याद है जब मैं प्रिपेयर करता होता था ना तो कोचिंग सेंटर्स भी साथ साथ होते थे एस सी टी का सेंटर लेफ्ट साइड पर आई टी जेई का राइट साइड पर सो नाउ फॉर यू गाइज टू गेट अ ग्रेट स्कोर इन एस सी टी एंड एस सी टी सब्जेक्ट आपको कोई कोचिंग इंस्टीट्यूट वगैरह ज्वाइन करने की जरूरत नहीं है यू जस्ट need to focus on self study because coaching institute is going to help you in two things strategies and practicing क्योंकि आप सारे टेस्ट जो भी कोचिंग इंस्टीट्यूट में आप सबके साथ करने वाले हैं यू कैन जस्ट डाउनलोड ऑनलाइन एंड टेक इट एट होम ट्राई डूइंग मैक्सिमम मॉक टेस्ट ट्राई डूइंग वन टेस्ट मिनिमम एवरी डे एंड चेक योर परफॉर्मेंस यू हैव टू आस कि मैंने ये क्वेश्चन गलत किया इफ आई डिड दिस क्वेश्चन रॉन्ग वट वॉज द रीजन यू शुड चेक द आंसर की एंड देर इज लाइक मैसेज रिटर्न दैट दिस इज द मिस्टेक फिक्स दिस मिस्टेक एंड देन टेक इट अगैन सो रोज एक टेस्ट दो एवरी डे टेक मिनिमम वन मॉक टेस्ट एंड आपकी आपकी स्किल्स बेटर होती जाएगी एंड मेनी स्टूडेंट्स दे गॉट लाइक हंड्रेड परसेंट लाइक फिफ्टीन फिफ्टीन वन वीक ऑफ स्टडी आफ्टर स्विचिंग फ्रॉम आई टी जेई to SAT so you will be able to do it easily and also for SAT subject test same strategy and also AP exams and for all AP exams you can check this video as well for depth in depth preparation and for SAT tips and tricks that you think ki aapko sirf tuition center se milti hai no you can also find those tips and tricks in the articles in the description below and also some of the great books so do check them out and now the conclusion is that SAT path is expensive kyunki agar aapko abroad jana hai in order to prepare for undergrad in US to take all these tests the kharcha the expenses are way too high so you have to spend like 1 lakh rupees to before before even going to US so that's why it is high but one most important thing you have to consider is that US is not the only option aapko baki options bhi consider karne chahiye because germany is also one of the easiest option because you can just take ielts and your board exams go to germany also for canada ielts toefl your board exam score go to canada and sat ielts toefl or uh, your board exam score for us is also good enough but out of these scores aapko sa एक्स्ट्रा करिकुलर्स पे भी ध्यान देना चाहिए एंड एक्स्ट्रा करिकुलर्स द बिगेस्ट द ईजिएस्ट वे टू गेट एक्स्ट्रा करिकुलर्स इज बाय जॉइनिंग ओलम्पियाड्स एंड टेस्ट सीरीज दिस टेस्ट सीरीज गिव यू रैंक्स एंड अगर आप ड्रॉप आउट भी करना चाह रहे हो तो ड्रॉप आउट के भी बहुत फायदे हैं बिकॉज फॉर एग्जाम्पल चित्रांग मुर्दिया सो ही एक्चुअली गॉट इन टू आई आई टी एंड आफ्टर दैट ही ट्रांसफर्ड सो उसकी भी स्टोरी इज कमिंग सून एज वेल सो दैट इज ऑल्सो पॉसिबल दैट वंस यू गेट योर नेशनल अचीवमेंट यू कैन गेट इन टू टॉप यूनिवर्सिटीज एंड इफ यू डोंट हैव ट्राई मे डॉकर यूनिवर्सिटीज लाइक यू टी are linkedin where you can study for 4 5 lakhs i mean the list is once again here so you should check out like affordable universities free universities you can study for free need blind etc to wahan pe ja ke check karo and explore all the options kyunki itni zyada options hai na you should explore and keep it as backup option and reduce your stress level and never ever think about committing suicide matlab kabhi bhi nahi because iit is not the only option that's what tuition you know, that's what tuition center tutoring centers have taught us but that's not the only option aapko sare options consider karne hai but remember to do one thing at a time sat ki preparation ki one month is over move on with boards and iit jai so after your board exams are over after class well take a jai means advance and if you don't do well in those 
apply for Germany because you can still apply after your class 12 because the deadlines are in July. And remember my words, kuch bhi difficult nahi hai, whether it is ITJ or SAT path, both are equally difficult. It's just about your passion and commitment. If your passion for physics, chemistry, math is higher than SAT, then you will do better in that. If your passion for SAT is more, then you will do better in, in that. So that's pretty much it. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.